Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Matt Latter and welcome back to RimWorld. Currently we are dealing with, well, some mechanoids that have already massively decimated our uh, people here. There's a lot of wounds going around and things are not looking all that great at the moment. So yeah, let's see how that will work out in uh, the long term, right? Uh... Hmm, not bad. So, I'll probably actually uh, do some skipping around and go for tube television. Just to keep the happiness up with our uh, sick people. Let's hope our sniper shots here uh, can take the centipede down. We're doing great work there so far and it shouldn't hold up that much longer, I hope. And you can actually also rest until heal, please. Come on, Clara. Shoot that beast. It's nearly down. At least according to its bar. Okay, fire the Scyther now. He's a bigger threat. Hit him a couple times just to uh, get his. Ouch! Fuck. Rescue her right again. So this shot went to her spine! Ah, oh, fuck! Man, fuck the Scythers! Fuck them to Kingdom Come. Okay, Elsie should be able to rescue her out there. Holy balls. You gotta be kidding me. Her left leg is shot off, she can never walk again. That means we'll have to do an operation. And install what is basically a new leg. So it is her left leg. This is not gonna be fun. Conley, do the operation. A wooden leg for Amanda. And Shanna's gotten sick from infection. What? She has a surgical cut in her neck. Because we got her a new leg. Okay, Conley, what's your medicine skill again? 9 out of 20? Well, I'm not sure what to say to that, really. I mean, are you? Like, hey, this guy needs a new leg, let's cut his neck? Oh boy. And we have a fire. Okay, at least far down there. Not like we care about that. This one we would care about, but it's going out on its own. So that's good. Clara and Kramer both are in a terrible mood. They might just go haywire and murder people uh, when they wake up. But at least we've got the centipede down. Clara's going insane. Kramer, try and get your daughter uh, to calm down. Rescue her. And then immediately treat her. Shit, man. Yeah, this is, <clears throat> this is the slow decline into uh, losing. You gotta be kidding me. He beats down his daughter, rescues her, because she is on a berserker rage, puts her into the medical bed, and then goes insane himself. You can't make this kind of shit up. Elsie? 
Please melee attack Kramer. We don't even have enough medical bats for this shit. Let's set up a few new ones. Rescue him. Okay, so we have four out of six people basically down and out. We'll need a lot of time administering uh, help to these people. So... Does wardening also include feeding only prisoners? Not good, not good. Okay, so Connolly is our last proper medical person. You are praying. Well, are you not the worst idea? Carol Moot, Clara, obviously. Clara, can you <clears throat> go and rest until healed? You'll need it. So, actually, can you prioritize feeding her first? <coughs> and then feed Amanda. How's Shen looking food wise? Pretty good, okay. Now treat Clara. In the meantime, the circle of death is ever expanding. <coughs> and the Scyther is still going around doing his usual bullshit. Clara is being healed. And Clara's got an infection. Great. Immediately go back to treating her. Okay, you're already on it. You've got a major infection and you're 39% towards uh, immunity. Shit's not looking good, guys. <coughs> you may have noticed that, I think. Elsie is, uh, funny enough, cutting stone. Mindless work that keeps her from realizing what is actually going on in here. While we're having fall, most of our crops have withered and died. And we probably don't have enough food to last us the winter. Cancel lavish meals. Simple meals come first. <coughs> we're doing our best. We're tending to the wounded... And Clara has gone crazy again. Only melee attack her. Holy shit, guys. We are getting shit upon. Ooh, boy. Okay, you know what, Elsie, you are also a doctor. We need you to help feed people and get wounds uh, cleaned up, everything you can do. <clears throat> Whatever it is, just do it. Yeah, they are massively dry deprived. We would actually kind of need the tube television now. Because we could just plop it down and they uh, could get some uh, entertainment from that. Well, Clara is researching. Shen is now hiding inside of his own room. <clears throat> I mean, how's the infection coming? Oh boy. In the meantime, this shit is still around and it has, I believe, reached the base of our crops now. Ooh boy. At least Clara is now taking care of herself. That's something. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of negatives in here. <coughs> okay, Kramer is fully healed. That's one step forward as well. 
Clara still needs treatment, I know. You can actually go rest until healed again. Conley, treat Clara. Get on that infection right away, basically. Uh, Shen is down here? No, where? where is Shen? He's hiding in this room. Oh, out here, okay. Uh, how long until next treatment? 1.1 hours. <clears throat> Let's see if he'll be uh, no longer crazy by the time he needs his next treatment. Would be preferable, but I doubt it. A lot of bad moods going around. Oh, the pack like installation didn't work actually. That's not good. Some cargo pods are dropping. Right outside our base, actually. You gotta be shitting me. Food right outside our doorstep. When we would kind of need it for the long term, and we can't get it. Now the game is mocking me. Like, seriously. Come on. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, um... Yeah, we need to deal with this Scyther still. Much as I would like to just uh, ignore his presence. No such thing possible. Come on, come into view. There we go. Let's hope for a solid hit. Nope. Another miss. Instead, shoot the centipede traps. That corner's gonna get destroyed, I just fucking know it. So actually... Severe illness! Shen, yeah. I guess that would happen quickly. Shen, oh you're out of mental break again, so rest until healed. Also, we need a builder. Because I need to be on the safe side, we need to build a slate wall, yes, 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 out here. Like frickin' yesterday. You should rest until you're healed, man. Oh, okay, you are... Oh, good, he developed the immunity. Very good. Okay, another step forward, then. Do we have any constructors? No, we don't. Shen, congratulations, you now ascended to be a constructor. Build me that blueprint wall here. Come on. There we go. Good. Hey, Elsie. Uh, needs are met? Mostly. Come into view, come into view. You asshole. Okay, then we'll shoot your pal out here. Ooh, that was a good hit. Right blade shot off. Poor movement ability. Good, 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 good. Damn. Solid hit. Torso. Right lung destroyed. Holy cow. Come on. Close. One more shot, then we'll leave. Or we won't. Because Elsie dies. Okay, another kick to the nuts. Clara, how are you? 
close to mentally breaking down and killing people, I guess. A combat supplier is passing by. How utterly great. Not like we can do anything with that. Conley, quickly call them. See what they have. A lot of stuff, but nothing... Well, medicine. We'll take the normal medicine, because medicine is helpful. We can't afford this deal. Oh, our entire silver is outside. Right, not a trade beacon there. Down to five people. The slow descent to death and madness continues. I mean, that's pretty apt, actually, yeah. That's what is actually happening. Okay, you should get the immunity before the uh, uh, infection becomes life-threatening. Uh, Athena is vomiting because she's got food poisoning. Right next to the hospital bats. That's pretty great, isn't it? Okay, Amanda. Uh, where is it? Health, operation. Install a peg leg. Try 2.0. Mental break! Kramer is walking a psychotic daze. Watch him walk outside and down to meet with the wonderful Scyther out here. Okay, let's see if the peg leg works out this time. Come on! A peg leg and no additional wounds. So that's something. Good, so at least Amanda is back up again soon. We have some more cargo pots. More food? No, actually this time they're giving us silver. Not like we can use much of it. So, how are you actually looking? Well, still massively dangerous. Let's wait until more people are up and running again. Okay, you've developed the immunity, so that's good. Needs-wise, you would need some food. So actually get up and get your food. Ah, and she is doing some science because that's joy for her. And more cargo pods. I think the game is trying to uh, make all the pain up to me, but that's not enough. Down to five colonists. A couple episodes ago we had how many exactly? I believe uh, nine? That hurts, man. I do have an idea what I could try to do, but... Not sure. No, 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 that wouldn't work out. I thought maybe to get an array of guns set up in here, like uh, the uh, sentry turrets, and then deconstruct the wall. But deconstructing the wall would automatically already lead to me being exposed to the scyther. So yeah, Kramer's outside and... Told ya! Bam! You've got your left second toe shot off. Left leg and left femur shot. Great times. Do we have a assault rifle still somewhere? Down here. Let's see if we can't use perhaps that... I'm loath to say it, but distraction. Kramer is dead. Guys, I seriously have no words for the shit that's going on out here. Go equip it and run the fuck away. Come on, Clara, you can do it. Avenge your father. Some solid hits there. 
Yeah, come on. Manipulation is already weakened. Come on. Avenge your father. Three solid hits. Might this be it? Might this be the redemption? Come on. Another hit. Another one. Come on. There we go. Holy fucking shit, it worked. Oh boy. Oh boy. Clara, you have a grisly task ahead of you. I know you're close to breaking. Very much so. And our colony might still be doomed, even after uh, taking them out. But you will have to create graves. And then... Strip your former friends and bury them. Okay, good. So... Only... Get yourself a shotgun. Actually, no, fuck it, you get a minigun. Amanda, you get a shotgun. The three of you move out here. It's time to end this ship. Oh, sorry for that, guys. So, I'm back. Sorry for the interruption. Um, I'll probably have to call this episode here. Uh, something came up. I can't really talk about it, but this time around, at least, it's very good news. I'm currently having a massive smile on my face, and maybe I can tell you about it in a few days, given permission. But so far, something really great happened, and... Yeah, fuck yeah. So, guys, thanks for watching. I hope to see you the next time.